hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel in today's video we will see how to reset and re-adopt the unify g3 instant camera on a unify product app this is my g3 instant camera from unify product and it stopped working due to the overheat outside temperature as you can see the red color led shows which means it is offline and i have to reconnect it to the unify protect application here i am resetting the unify protect camera by pressing the reset button at the bottom of the g3 instant once factory reset is completed the led on the g3 instant camera will be flashing white and we'll have to wait it for it to get stable white so it will be ready on the unify protect application to adopt So here after reset it came up on the unify product application as a new device found as the unify g3 instant is booting after it boots we can reconnect it to the product application so it scan for the nearby wi-fi networks after booting the unify g3 instant it says tap to reconnect but is still unable to manage it so we have to first remove it from the unify product app and then we can add it later After removing, it came back on the Unify product as tab to adopt. After adopting, it will locate the Wi-Fi network and as soon as you connect to the Wi-Fi SSID, uh, it will start connecting to that SSID. But the Cloud Key Gen 2 is on different network as to the G3 instant, so it will give you an error. Please make sure the Unify Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus and the G3 instant is on the same network. After that, I will make sure the Unify G3 Instant and the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus is on the same network. So I have created a new SSID and try to connect the Unify G3 Instant to the same Wi-Fi networks. So the procedure is the same and we have to connect to the same SSID. Once you are connected to the SSID, the Unify G3 Instant will be added to the Unify product. So this is how you can reset and re-adopt the Unify G3 Instant on the Unify Protect app. 